Okay, hi guys, Akumodo Crypto here with another Bitcoin update. My Twitter guys, I just presented you guys with this setup here. Uh, I'm gonna discuss about it and discount here. Okay, okay, let's see the daily chart. Um, this is, let's first talk about my previous count, right? This is this was this is my this is one of this is an alternate count. It's not completely uh, out of the table now, but it's difficult to hold it. Okay, one well, now we are we pretty much crossed the 55 EMA, which is a nice support for the daily. Uh, it, it was the last support that we had because we finished yesterday below the 100. And we see that the 21 EMA here is crossing the 100 one. So it's going to be difficult, right? It's going to, it's difficult to hold any kind of bull, uh, bullish count now, okay? Really difficult. So this was my count. This is a possible count. It's, uh, it's not likely now because I don't, I was expecting to see this X. Why? Because it would give the the bear the the bears a lot of fuel to dump and have a new low here. Okay, this would be uh, a nice count, but we are not looking here for something that is uh, beautiful or effective for us. We need to react to the market, and that's why I need to disregard this count for at least the moment and uh, look at something that is more likely for what we have now that's why i'm presenting you guys with discount which we have this sharp correction w then we have an x okay this x here is 38 20 percent of retracement of this wave here not the best x ever but nevertheless it's an x a b c uh any tree okay x is composed of any tree then we have a clear tree here not, not the build, not the most beautiful tree but nevertheless this is what we have we need to count and we need to react to, to what we have then we have this pattern here that it's pretty interesting right because we have this down up it's like getting always uh, lower lo lower lows and lower uh, lower lows and lower highs what I'm proposing is that we are gonna stop this pattern. We, we, we won't be getting new lows here, okay? But I'm proposing it. Let's dig into this count. Inside of this last wave Y, okay? Inside of this last wave Y, we have again a W, X, and Y, which I presented as a, a, this white count here, this white W, X, Y. Inside of the Y, okay? Inside of this last Y green here, we have a WXY. And it, this one is pretty clear because we have this W, this white one ABC, really clear ABC. And then we have a X that's pretty clear, not easy to count as a ABC though, but this would be our ABC. And this X here has retraced 618, which is a nice retracement for our for our um, 618, 65%, for our X, this is a nice retracement, okay? Then we have our A, this is an A, B, C, that whole structure, yeah? That's going down, that we have discussed already, yeah? Let me just change it to micro and bullet blue, okay? A, B, C for our A, this would be our A. And then what we would have here? would have an A, B, C, D, E. We would have finish B here. This would be this whole structure here. A, B, C. Remember, guys, um, just, uh, just, just a quick digression here. Remember that I was talking about this structure here not being impulsive. Yes, so it's not impulsive. It's a correction. It's a leading diagonal correction. I was talking about it for so long. And I was so convinced that this was not a motive impulse. Because it was not looking like one. And it's not. Why? 
because this whole structure here is corrective. Now I'm happy because I wasn't really crazy proposed that this was a leading, a corrective leading diagonal. And this is a tree, 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 tree structure. Really clear, really, really clear. If you look at my previous uh, Twitter, uh, my previous tweets, sorry, I have been proposing this as a, a corrective leading diagonal for a long time. But of course, due to, due to the, the pressure of the mark that I was looking at something that was bullish, I need to change my count. It doesn't matter. I wouldn't be forcing this count unless I am proving, I, unless I have more data. And now I have more data. This is corrective. This is correcting this structure here, this A. This is correcting. See this wave here? This is my way. B, and then we have our C. Okay, guys. What I have been proposing is that this structure here, where, where, where is it? This structure here is A, B, and C. Exactly what we have here, A, B, and C. Okay? This C here. Beautiful. And this is way better than whatever count that we had before. Sorry. Sorbos, but this bear count here is beautiful because we have this structure here of an A, B, and a C, a corrective A leading diagonal, trees A, B, C, trees A, B, C, 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 you see, trees, 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 and trees, five trees, okay, and if you go in the book you have this pattern okay i'm not creating it guys i'm always here i'm always here presenting you guys with data presenting you guys this is the leading diagonal a corrective pattern okay <clears throat> this is the pattern and i'm presenting you guys okay but this is i want you to for five i want you to look at the other one where is it um this is the flat it's important we are studying together aren't we is it the leading diagonal corrective pattern? Oh, yes, this is the, this is it. Uh, I don't think I have the example here in the book, but it's, yeah, it, it, this is it, okay? But this is the leading diagonal normal leading diag. This is not the normal, the, the corrective one. The corrective leading diag I have here at my, my Twitter, I have, I have tweeted it, but it's a long time ago, because it was like I, I'm always presenting you guys with uh, an example from the book or for from some data. This is it? No, this is not it. I'm oh, sorry for being. No, no. See, this is interesting, right? Because I propose a lot of different counts and different uh i'm always trying to I, I, i'm giving support to my counts i i give you guys data though this is the structure okay leading diagonal in a corrective wave a see i, I proposed this was like jul 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 20 and <laughs> july 20 <laughs> Not 20 T, bro. Ain't it? <laughs> this was the structure. And I was saying, oh, this is corrective. This is corrective because of the, the way that it looks like, right? And now I, I'm happy because, yes, I, this is beautiful. This is, this is a corrective structure. If this plays out, this is our A, B, C. And then we are going to have something like this. Okay, perhaps this is now this is a hypothetical okay we might have a, a a wave that goes down here and touch this yellow one here but I think that we are not gonna have a new low but we are gonna correct in time we are gonna continue going like this sideways okay so this is my 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 hour chart we are now finishing this wave three and this is way better to count than the, the the alternative this is remember guys this was a wave four okay as i i have proposed yesterday okay i i don't i am not afraid to be wrong guys i'm always wrong and i i i tell you guys that i'm wrong and i show you guys that i'm wrong 
I was counting it like this. Okay, A, B, C. Okay, and then I had my stop loss. Oh, this is no, not this one. I had one with the with the stop loss. Stop loss here. You see, this was my my count. But then I, it's it, this is really difficult to no, not this. This old. This is EOS. Come on, man. What the fuck you're doing? <laughs> this is. Okay, and then I propose that we might have something like this, but it's not gonna be a one, two, three, four, five like this. It's gonna be a zigzag. Okay. Sorry, I'm wrong. I was wrong, and I'm gonna be wrong all the time. This is this is how we 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 learn and how we chart, how we analyze, allowing ourselves to be wrong. So now I'm using the the extension tool here to calculate where we would. This is our tree here. It's clear. It's a clear tree. One, two, and then we have this whole structure as a tree. Perhaps we have one more push down to get to the 116, 1618%, 175%, okay? Then the fourth wave, which I'm proposing here, set up, we would, that we would retrace to this resistance here. We would have a wave like this, okay? Beautiful, isn't it? And this will, this is the targets here. Perhaps we go a bit higher to the 50%. Not a problem at all. My stop loss would be at this resistance here. Okay, at the 50% of the whole structure. Here we have it. This is my stop loss. Okay, stop loss is here. Which I think we are not going to hit, but I... This is not a, a bad setup, I think. Huh? Stop loss is here. I know I should put green, right? Because it's a stop loss. But we are gonna buy, so green, buy. You get it, right? So we might get to this 50%, but no problem. I'm gonna leather my shorts, okay? And this is the 30, 38-20%. This is the sweet spot for a wave four. This resistance here is gonna be really important for us to leather our shorts. And then we're gonna go down. This would be our A, okay? That's it. It's really easier to count this way, really easier. Then we have this A, B, and a C that I'm proposing you guys, okay? Not challenging the, the lowest low of the year, not challenge the lowest low, so we have, we have a B, C. Here we're gonna have an A, B, C. This is gonna be a A. We are finishing this A now, B, and a C. Then the same thing here, A, B, C. Then the same thing here, A, B, and C. This is kind of the pattern that's gonna, this is gonna stall for time, okay? This is gonna make Bitcoin really uh, going sideways, up and down, but not really doing much, okay? And confusing the market, which is important, okay? Because people is gonna lose money now. Oh, we are we are actually in a bullish market. No, we are not. Uh, me included, okay? Me included. Well, of course, we react to it. We react to it with emotion. We are not machines. We are not something that. <laughs> we are not an algo, <laughs> and we are we are playing against machines, okay? We are playing against machines that trade that trade way better than us. But we need to be smart. We need to understand what's going on and react. Okay, this is one play that it's a. Um, uh, if this happens, it's gonna be a good short. But if it goes up, remember that I proposed yesterday. This, if you follow me on Twitter, I proposed this. My stop loss is 7164. Okay, it's, we haven't reached this, this stop loss here, not yet. So as I said yesterday, if we get to this stop loss, I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna switch to the short mode. Let's call it that way. I'm not, I'm gonna switch to this count here, and then I'm gonna short. One or the other is gonna play. It's I'm not gonna be in the middle of it. One way or the other, I'm gonna make money. I'm gonna play this setup, and I'm gonna make money. If I the money that I lost here at my stop loss, I'm gonna get it again i'm gonna get back okay that's 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 what we should do guys think about 
different scenarios and play accordingly. Okay, this is a support that's becoming resistance. So then we need to think about it. We broke it. This was a support. Now we broke it. This is going to be a resistance. Then we are going to see this wave four, perhaps, which I'm calling wave four, perhaps going to the 50%. And then we ladder our shorts and then we wait for it to go down. Okay. Um, that's it for today. If you like my content, uh, please, you like it <laughs> and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Follow me on Twitter to see different counts, to see different alternatives. And as always, enjoy your trades, guys. Awesome to have you here. Thank you very much. Have a wonderful weekend. Bye bye. Cheers. <laughs>